Uh, some breaking news in the sports world. Tom Brady uh, announced that he's retiring. He said, quote, for good this time. Uh, so he's being serious about it, I'm told. A and look, I know you can be somebody like Sam Flannel that accuses him of being the luckiest player that's ever played <sighs> in the NFL. But the bottom line, though, Lindsay, is this. When you run through those numbers, seven-time Super Bowl champion, five-time Super Bowl MVP, 15-time Pro Bowl, or three-time All-Pro, all of it. You know, all you guys know the numbers. A goat's walking away, man. And it does feel for real, doesn't it? It, it does, man. I, I was... Uh... I got sad watching him sit there with the little uh, video. I was like, man. You start crying? I didn't cry. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, it's really happening now. You know, we're, we're watching the end of uh, an era of one of the greatest to ever do it. No, and, and Neil Logan in the WilbertSports.com chat thread says, I'll believe it when I see that he'll be back. And, and it just, I don't know what you guys felt. And Spenny, like, I talked about this coming down the stretch of the season. It just, he looked different. And I know, like, numbers wise, per se, like, numbers weren't that far off or anything like that. But I just, I got the feeling. It didn't it seem like he was kind of trudging through everything. Yeah, it looked bad. And especially in that last, uh, in that playoff game against Dallas, it looked bad. I mean, it's, it's hard to play well against a defense like that that creates so much pressure. But. You could tell that it was, it was starting to go a little bit. Maybe it was his offensive line not being healthy that didn't help at all. But it, it was time. It was time for him to hang it up. And respect to Tom Brady. He's one of my favorite players of all time. So it's sad to see him go, but it was, it, it was time.